sandwich-based economy. I, I am in need of international rescue. Oh, mm, wishes for your salads. Edible. Fine. I broke another bowl. Empty bowls are now a currency. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this sounds like an adventure, and I could do with an adventure. Okay, I found the lava. That's a cow. Cows and pigs. Yeah, there's a lot of wildlife around, I've noticed. Snippy's having to do his job. He's <laughs> in slaughtering them all. What's that? Just a flower. I guess oh. I should probably be making some maybe. New trees. Let me just see what these trees are. My inventory is full already. <laughs> oh, it's oak trees. Okay. Is that what we need? Yeah, we don't have any oak saplings. I shall collect some while we're here. While I'm passing. Just gives us another type of wood to build from then. Still getting very large samples out here. <laughs> I have got a pile of crap in my inventory that I can get rid of should I need to. I have a bunch of chests. I think I built two full chests right here, so I have a ton of crap as well. Now oh, what's that? Looks like spherolite. Right, I shall make a note of these coordinates for Starlight. I don't know if we'll still be needing bronze, but you never know. Well, it depends on how thoroughly we're obtaining everything else. One, mm. two, three. 
like how thoroughly we're getting iron. Okay, uh, right. I was heading what this way. Oh, there's a cave down there. Did you go down into the cave? Maybe. Uh, like I said, I took a roundabout route, so... <coughs> Excuse me? What are you up to, Mir? Trying to process all the meat Stimpy left me. Oh, the cave opens up into, like, a ravine. Hmm. There's a lot of ravines around here. Ooh, that actually looks interesting. We must explore that. Chip Jasper. Oops, fell down a hole. Was a heading that way. We might run into that ravine now. Yep. Feral lights on the ground? Yeah, I've noticed a lot around. Uh, it was never like, it was just like, eh. Because, um. Yeah, because I'm like I said, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, a uh, fruit tree and blossom. I'll be right back. Okay. Wow, mountain that looks like a dinosaur because of its overhang. Look at that, Mir. Well, it's a bit of a chubby dinosaur, is it? Well, yeah. But, you know, we don't hold that against dinosaurs. 
that's the last thing you can hold against dinosaurs nowadays. What is that? They were chubby. I'm back. That Hi. they are chubby. I'm pretty sure that you can't call dinosaurs chubby anymore. Because they're dead. Yeah. Oh, carrots over there. We don't need carrots, do we? I've got picked up some green. I do enjoy green. Also carrots. Also have a cat. <laughs> hello, cat. Luna, say hello. Good girl. Oh, and he did. She did. She did. She she's the really talkative one. Yeah. She, like she she's all black and um. I think it's like a survival mechanism because, well, she likes to sit on dark spots on the carpet. So <laughs> at night, she's hard to see. So she got her tail stepped on a couple times. So Aww. now, whenever anyone walks near her, she just kind of. <laughs> so. Try holding the cat up again so Sal can see it. Uh, she ran away. Oh. How rude. <laughs> yep. That's what she does. But yeah, she's uh, she doesn't have a, um, she doesn't have a bad bone in her body. She uh, she'll let you do just about anything to her and just meow at you. Like she won't hiss or scratch or anything. Uh, I am at minus eight thousand six hundred. Where am I going to again? <laughs> I'm currently standing at uh, uh so uh, X. Oh. <laughs> so X negative ninety four. Yeah. Um, Z negative eight thousand seven hundred and thirty three. I think you might have been on the wrong way. So probably I maybe gave you false information. Oh no, I just kind of headed over in this direction and figured that you know That's once good. I was in the minus eight thousands, I'd give you a shout and find out. Right, of course this doesn't work. The fire went out and I'm standing in front of a cold campfire pit waiting for something to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Venison and horse meat take ages to cook. It's because of all the horseplay. I feel like there was a joke there that I didn't oh. get. I can see something in the side of that mountain. Have you got a mountain that looks like a dinosaur? Climbing. Um, no, a mountain that looks like it's got a, a big head that sticks out of it. <laughs> I think that's the one I was calling a dick mountain. Ah. But that, I can't remember where that is. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you run directly underneath the protrusion. Yep. Um, I'm pretty close to it. Okay. I'm pretty lit up. I have a bunch of torches and like it's pretty obvious where it is. Or where I am, I should say. That doesn't work. Get out of your cow. Or it will turn you into food. Please don't. We've got too much meat at the moment. And for us out here. <laughs> Our mining colony, oh, my mining colony doesn't really have too much food right now. Although we do have a lot of meat now. Because of that cow's friends. <laughs> okay, I am under the protrusion. Okay, keep running in that direction. Like straight under it. I am as under it as sure? under it gets. Oh, I'll come up and meet you actually. Okay. Because it is a hop, skip, and a jump. And have you noticed the ore in the side of the mountain? It's pinkish, but it might be copper. Uh, I think this one was copper. Turn on, Sal. Hello. Hello. Yeah, uh, just around this side. Ah, oh, here you go. Yeah, there's copper it's... on the floor, so it'll be copper in there. Oh, okay. The hill. So we are... The mine is right over here. Bite. No, it's right here. Hmm. 
with our mine mascot, the cow. <laughs> we could later if we needed to. Mm -hmm. Right, but it's I, right down here. Uh, I have food and stuff. Cool. I'm actually doing pretty good on food right now. You can just throw it in okay. any of the chests. Let's see. Um, there's a thing of salads in that one. And a thing of sticks in that one. Sweet. I'm just going to put some of my inventory away. I've already got a fair amount of uh, iron, which is nice. So behind me, mm -hmm. that shaft that I'm not working, um, it ends where the torch is on the ground. So that's where it turns into a large instead of a very large right here. Uh huh. And then I'm looking on this side. Now let me see where this goes. That I did the prospecting trick, so I think we should be pretty close to the middle of the deposit. And the deposit is mostly on this level. Cool. To be honest, I've hit a fair amount, so. Um, I have brought a water supply. Cool, same. I have the one up top, which I forgot I was carrying. Cool. So if you want right. to start going, I guess, this way? Yep. From, like, over here. Try to get the good old X shape, X factor. Mm-hmm. So I'll just dig in here. Um, I think I shall... Oh, I don't have... I haven't brought any support beams, so I'll just make... Have you got plenty, uh, or shall I make... You just take the wood. Them? Yeah. There's wood and there's salt there. I have... I've got a um, salt. A stack in a little bit, so... There's also a chisel and a hammer up there, too, if we feel so inclined to bring back a bunch of smooth stone. Just put my tools on a tool rack. Cool. Just in case. Uh, right. I'll put up an intermediary support beam there just to stabilize things while I mine. So I found the end on this side. Had a bit of a minor collapse in the other shaft, but mm -hmm. too serious. We're working pretty close to the surface. We're working yeah. pretty close to the surface, though, so you gotta be a little bit careful.
I've brought um, a whole thing of torches as well. Cool. I should knock out supports while I'm standing underneath. Where did I knock from? <laughs> Just in case. Uh, you have a pro pick, right? Yes, I do. Can you come give this wall a smack? Because mine just broke. Sure. Uh, oh, I need to drink. Mm. Okay, uh, which wall? Here? The end wall, like the back wall, yeah. Very large. Cool. I'll keep going. Yep. Yeah. And I'm still getting very large over here as well, I think. Oh no, just large, okay. Very large. So this is where the transition is here. I'll follow behind you and put up supports. Cool. <laughs> I think we probably hit the end of it because I haven't seen any in a while. Uh, traces down here. Yep, yep. Medium. Very large here. Cool. Large there. Okay, so actually, if I move that torch up. there so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty two 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 three two four two five two six two seven twenty eight <coughs> so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen forty so the centre is about the centre of the cross. Yeah, like I, I kind of eyeballed it from the surface, so it was one of those like, see right. if it is the same thing on the ground. Oops. <laughs> I went to jump across it and went up the ladder instead. <laughs> Very large there, okay. Right, we're still getting very large over here, so I shall... I'll, I'll just expand out this way a bit more.
Yeah, there's a bunch on the layer underneath us. Hmm. I'm going sports so here to go back up and make some more. So do you think we need to go down? Uh, yeah, I went down like just basically another layer, and there's a ton, so... Right. Still very large. So I found a chipped emerald. Jim Han says we gotta go deeper. <laughs> large here. Large. Very large. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Tons of this stuff. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> wow. It's everywhere. Yeah. I think if we see it in the roof because we're so close to the mine above us we're probably better digging down rather than up uh, we're two yeah there's, so there's we're one layer or sorry we're two layers deeper than the floor above so yeah. if it's in our roof then there's one more block above that one all this game needs is for them to put in earthquakes. <laughs> well, we did try to play a Terra Firma craft version with tornadoes enabled, which would I assume would at least do something similar on the surface level. Did we? Wow. We did. We didn't get very far, though. <laughs> Uh, Terry says, a new sinkhole in the making. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, you took the saw with you, didn't you? <laughs> took both saws. Yeah, we've got both saws. Sorry. I noticed. <laughs> How kind of you. 
I least. guess I don't want to build a windmill, I guess. No. Nope. Like, uh, okay. Uh, unless you want to learn how to forge. No, not really. Never I guess mind. in theory, in theory, if we had a saw mold, you could just pour, yeah. pour a saw. Because of ingots, so if you put, in, if, you put uh, if you hit a uh, crucible with a pickaxe, you can um, place it on top of the forge. You can heat it up and then put one of the ingots in it, and then put the mold for the saw in the ingot mold slot. Need to make some more supports. I think I might be out of wood, so I have to go do some chopping. Right. I uh, brought an axe as well. Um, which way was the. It was that way. That way and that way. So it's back to the ladder and to the right. Back to the ladder and to the right. Oh yeah. That sounded rumbly. Oh, it was just me being dumb. I'll get it. Wasn't anything. Uh large or scary. I put a cobblestone block on top of a um, support to uh, uh, make it right. support it. Yeah. And then not put the support and I went, oh, right. Cobblestone isn't, your cobblestone is affected by gravity. I've dropped some down on you there, Spidey. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I think we need to make our voyage back home. We have a quite a large amount of iron. Okay. my water vessel on the first level. There it is. Actually, first. give you the hematite that I've got a loose one there oops yep you just throw it at me I'll give you the other one as well in my I'll take those raw hides back I'm sure they'll come in useful So that chest is just basically just full of dirt. Yeah.
How are you done? Full up. I think we got everything. Okay. Um, Unless we want to take back all this, like, rock, but I don't think so. I'll take back as much as I've got room for. Yeah, yeah Alma did deplete our rock reserves. We can only make calls from it, but... Yeah. It's not smooth. I have a chip Jasper and a chip Emerald. And I've got a chip to Amethyst. Hmm. I think that's less useful than the uh, the dirt, actually, though. <laughs> uh, yeah, but we can hmm. start a Dragon's Horde. Indeed. We could leave all this stuff out here. We'll probably be coming back to this mine eventually. Yeah? Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, I've kind of got it now, though. <laughs> right. All right, ready? Do you know the way back? Yep. Maybe. I'm going to assume it's this way. I'm just going to run in a straight line until the sun comes out from behind all these clouds. I have a thorough amount of food anyway, so... Oh, I tell you what, uh, if we happen to spot that ravine again, it would be worth, um, well, that cave, the cave that leads into the ravine is marvellous. It was near the Svarite, though, so I can soon find it again. Cool. Oh, there's the cherry tree. I passed the cherry tree on my way here. Come on, it. Stuck in the hot spring. <laughs> it's soothing and wonderful. There we go. I'm free. I'm on I'm top of the hill the behind the cherry tree. Because I remember coming this way. Cool. If I can get out of this water. I presume it's the same cherry tree. Oh. I see you. I'm on the other hill. Hello. Look straight across the cherry tree. Oh yeah, <laughs> <Same> I see <laughs> you. <laughs> There's a lot of hot springs around here. Oh, carrots. Yeah, I can see carrots over here too. Mind you, I've not got inventory space for carrots. Well, I have a bunch of carrot seeds anyway. Yeah. And Mir doesn't seem too enthused by carrots. Yeah. I've been picking up grains. I figured grains are a good mm -hmm. thing to have. No, oh, no, we're good on grains now. Oh, are we? I've brought it for you anyway. You wouldn't reject my gift, would you, Mir? I didn't reject the fish you gave me. True. Oh, yeah, there's a one. there's a deer. That means we're in bear country. Hematite there. Oh, but can't pick it up because I've got inventory full of rocks. Oh yeah, I remember coming past these boulders. I should be following you, because you ran over here. Uh-huh. Whereas I took a roundabout little trek. Question is... Oh, I almost fell out of ravine. That's um, an odd question. <laughs> the question is, where did Sal go? Oh, hang on, I'll stand on top of the hill. I see you. Yeah. And it was pretty much a straight line. From this way? Yeah. Cool. So 
sprinting. Sprinting has never led me astray, especially through dense woods. <laughs> the ravine country. Oh, 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 was this where I found... Found a beach. Yeah, yeah, I'm on the beach. I'm just wondering oh. if... If the ravine... Was there a ravine here? I want to find that cave again because it was... A, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, so... Here's the ravine. And it's full of caves. Oh, oh, oh. And holes. The ravine came up quick. Yeah. Um... Because I had to detour around here. It's a sunken land. Cool. Mm. Wow, it's a deep one. And it's full of caves. Was here's, in there a little bit. Here's a cave here that leads down into it. Cool. Wow, and it goes really deep. Uh, I should get my ladders out. Do you fancy exploring the cave a bit? Uh, maybe next week? Because we know where it is now. True. Because I don't have too much more time. Oh, I'll be okay. starting with exploring. We're going to get more cave exploring. Yeah, there's loads of caves. We're find something that we don't want to well. leave. Um, let me get the coordinates of this entrance because it looks like a nice mm -hmm. one. Is um, x is minus two four seven, z is minus nine oh eight two. Okay, I'm just further down the beach. Okay, uh, I did actually go back cross country, but well, in theory, this beach should lead us home. Right? Yeah. That's probably faster running around the edge than going cross country. Yeah, you don't have to worry about dodging trees. Yeah. Bears. Bear trees. Soggy beef. <laughs> yeah, I'm just eating a bit of soggy bread. Because it's both raining and rain water. <laughs> it was a dark and stormy night. Hmm, it was. Although not very stormy, we've had bigger storms than this. Yeah. Like the non-stop lightning for like a good minute mm -hmm. when I was in the one cave. Mm, might just actually just run around instead of swimming. Mm, I'll swim, I think. Let's just have a look. Minus nine. Some three. I'm not sure that we're heading in the right direction. <laughs> I think oh. we, I think the coast might be taking us on a bit of a wild goose chase. We need to be heading this way. We need to be heading north. Cool.
Oh no! My what? vessel broke. Oh. Or my like water. You water jug. Jesus! Jug. Don't scream that so <laughs> loud. There's some people slowly dying here without a saw. Don't worry, we're bringing a saw back. Bringing two saws back. Mm. Too late. Just keeping an eye open for horses as well. Found some rice. I also saw a haystack, so we're probably close. Ooh, that's a big hole. Ooh, it's up raining. Yay! Oh, I don't remember that ravine. I was re reading chat and I almost found a ravine. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a ravine God damn it, Terry. with a hot spring in it. Mm. Schnazzy. Yeah. Quite the upmarket ravine. Um, I was going to say. Uh, Terry says, "I got half a yeah. You, know, you you've got half a ton of iron on you, and you can still run across the bay. Yep, swim across the bay. That's how it works. But you still can't put more than 100 ounces of garlic in a jar. <laughs> oh, is this is a cherry tree. I found a cherry tree. Do we need more fruit trees, Mayor? No, no, no. We'll be mostly fine. The only thing we could stock up on would be olives. Ah, um, we don't actually know what the trees are until we chop them. Oh, there's cherry trees in bloom, so... Oh, do you know, I was expecting this bay to be our bay, and it blatantly isn't. Put F3 back on. That's cheating. <laughs> oh, just a bay too short, I think. I'm now full on cherries <laughs> with a full stack. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a bear. Uh, it's a cow. I thought it was a bear. Wow, I found a 100% black horse. Oh, have you? Is it male? Mm -hmm. Female. Ah. It was quite angry with me checking as well. 